If you guys need ultimate team coins, go and check out IGSky.com. Their link will be down in the description. They have a variety of different ways of delivering coins, even with the price caps. They're fast, cheap, and reliable. Use code CAPGUN to get yourself a discount. You're right guys, it's Capgun Tom here and welcome to something a little bit of a change of pace my channel. I haven't done one of these in absolutely ages but I thought, you know what, now is as good as time as any to go and try out some of the new players that have been released and uh, effectively what this is, is almost a full future legend squad builder. So every player in this squad, there's a couple of iffy ones, but pretty much every player in this squad has the potential to get themselves a legend card down the line. So very exciting and the stats on these cards are probably reflective of what the legend card might actually have on it. So very exciting to go and try out this team. Now I'm getting pretty active on Snapchat so if you want to follow me my username is CapgunTom. Go add me, go check out my stories. You basically get an insight in what I get up to on a day to day basis. It's mainly player FIFA. But anyway, let's dive in and start building this squad. It is unbelievable. So let's start off with the goalkeeper. Of course, it's going to be none other than Buffon. We've gone out, we've splashed out and got his team of the season card. If he doesn't get a legend card, there is something seriously wrong. It was very sad to see him get knocked out of the Euros. But he took it like a true sportsman. Absolute Hero. So in goes Buffon, and I think you can probably guess how this team is going to go. He's going to use a lot of the new classic EU cards or European cards that were released last Friday. I actually managed to pack loads of them. If you want to go check out my video where I packed loads of those cards, including two of the best, or in fact I think it three, maybe the three best, then uh, I'll leave a link to that down in the description. Now, we've got Buffon. And I think that we'll, we'll go up top. Let's go up top. So at the striker position, we are going to be using David Villa. Absolute legend. I mean, was at Barcelona for ages, Valencia before that. He's, you know, r unbelievable player. And he was so good for Spain as well. Um, obviously out in the MLS. What's going to happen with the MLS team of the season? That makes me do a little, like wonder just a little bit what might happen there. But you can see there, David Villa. Best thing about him, five-star weak foot and four-star skills to go along with his 93 pace 91 shooting and 89 dribbling of course would think he gets a legend card as well now you probably saw him already the other striker is going to be none other than Fernando Torres whether he gets a legend card I don't know if you ask a Liverpool fan 100% he's getting a legend card but I don't know there was since you know leaving Liverpool going to Chelsea his career sort of just sort of maybe plateaued gone down a bit so I'm not 100% sure whether we'll actually see a legend card for him in future years but still a very nice card on FIFA and definitely one I'm excited to try out I haven't actually used this team yet and I think it's going to be boss so 90 pace on that 89 shooting and 87 dribbling very nice at the centre attack in mid position we've got probably the legend of all legends and that is Perlo you're probably thinking Perlo at camp need it to make the hybrid work and uh, you can see he gets that strong link into the uh, just look at the 98 passing on this card. I can't wait to get on the pitch and start playing a few through balls to Torres and Villa. Um, he obviously has like 87 dribbling and 72 shooting. Also quite interested to see what his free kicks are like because uh, that was sort of what he was known for back in the day as well as his unbelievable passing. Now at the centre mid position, first off, we're using Totti. This guy retired this year, definitely. Fingers crossed getting a legend card next year on FIFA 17. If he does, I'll be very happy because I've always been a huge fan of Totti, especially on FIFA. Love playing with him. Even in the previous years where his pace has been completely crippled, I've still enjoyed playing with his card. Um, they've actually boosted his pace massively for this card. So he's got 78 pace. He's also got 89 shooting, 91 passing, and 93 dribbling. That's pretty spectacular. I've put him into the centre mid position. Maybe you guys don't agree with that, but... I don't care. I still think he's got. I think he's got the stats to play in midfield as well as playing centre attacking mid. What I might do is I might switch Perlo and uh, uh, Totti around once the game actually starts. Okay, now at the right centre mid position, you know, let's go with the left centre mid. Let's go left centre mid. It's gonna be Stevie G. This guy deserves a legend card. Absolutely fantastic player. It was years and years of service for Liverpool. You know, won the Champions League. Played for England for years as well. I would highly, well, I, I think this is probably one of the most eagerly wanted legend cards. Of course, all of these players need to retire before there's actually a chance they'll get a legend card. But, you know, Steven Gerrard goes in there, 91 pace, 87 shooting, 88 physical on his card. 
Man, I'm actually super excited to try out this team. At left back, we've got a perfect link going into Steven Gerrard, which is what, he, what we actually need that, because otherwise this team wouldn't work. It's Ashley Cole. He has 92 pace on this card as well as 86 defending and 82 dribbling and 78 physical. That is a very frightening card. One of the highest rated left backs on the game now as well. So, yeah, again, can't wait to get out and try this card. And um, obviously... I think he's a bit of a legend as well. Right, okay, let's go on to the right centre mid. We've got Iniesta, the only normal card in the entire squad. I wanted to buy his team of the year, but he's too expensive, guys. I actually ran out of coins building this team, so I had to get the regular Iniesta. You've all seen his team of the years, his international man of the match to play before, so I hope you're not too upset. Definitely deserves a legend card. I mean, I'm not even going to go on to I'm not even going to talk about him. He's like, literally a legend. Um, Danny Alves. I think that he'll get a legend card. He's been in like the World Eleven year after year after year after year. I just can't see him not, you know. He's been one of the best right backs in football in pro well, probably of all time. So, um, yeah, he gets it. And I'd say he's probably, maybe, he's one of the iffier ones that might get a legend card. So there you go, Danny Alves. I still think that he deserves it and he probably will get it. Especially with 93 pace, 91 dribbling on this card, 90 defending. It's an unreal card. Right, so the centre backs, you're obviously guessing where we're going. We're going... To freaking Serie A. We're going to Juventus. We're going to be using Barzagli and Keely. And again, these are slightly more um, iffy ones as to whether they will get the legend card or not. You know, there's already so many amazing Italian centre backs that have played throughout the year. You know, we're talking Maldini, we're talking uh, Nesta. Yeah, it's just, there's just too many to name. So um, there's Cannavaro as well, already all got legend cards. So um, yeah, maybe these guys will get one. I don't know, have to wait and see. Let me know what you think down in the comments section. Guys, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna dive into some games. Okay, so here we are. We're gonna play some games and see what we come up against. So, first game, 4-3-3. He's got that international man match, Higuayi. Decent squad. Oh, got that. Chiellini's the man. Ooh, he's still going somehow. What the fuck was that? Oh my God, it's actually come to Gerard. Oh, you'd expect him to bury that. Oh, I get across, Fernando Torres is waiting, here it is, go! Oh my, what? How has Courtois saved that? Here we go, let's have that. Oh my god! Oh, Totti! Oh my god, I literally can't score. Oh, the little flick on, David Villa! Yes! We break the deadlock, it's 1-0! Oh goodness me, what a fool that is to David Villa. He's through. David Villa and it's 2 0. Oh, we got man massively on side. It's none other than Fernando Torres. He's through a goal. Let's finish it, Fernando. 3 0. GBG. Oh, Perlo. Please. That's filthy. That's filthy from Perlo. Here's Totti, the main man. Oh, my lord, it's a penalty. David Villa steps up to complete the hat trick. Top left, boys. Oh, my god, he's actually saved it. No, he hasn't. 4 0. Oh, he's brought Courtois. Stevie G. Oh! What did he do that for? Oh, he's denied Steven Gerrard an unbelievable goal. Here he comes. Oh, that's good. Here he is again. Steven Gerrard. Get past him. He shoots. Oh, what a banger from Steven Gerrard. That was beautiful play from the boys to make the space and get him in. It's Totti on the edge of the box. Finesse. Oh, my God. He's hit someone. Oh, Via! Oh, shoot! Oh my god, what a disgusting goal. But Steven Gerrard's there again, he's on a hat trick. Oh, we got a man through. It's Fernando Torres. Here he goes. Fernando, he's pushed off, but it's gone in anyway. How did he manage that? What a goal. That's a great tackle from Iniesta. Oh, Totti puts him through, and it's a goal. 4 0. It's all just like the floodgates have opened right now. <laughs> he rage quit, what a surprise. What's our next opponent using? Oh, look at that. Non rare other than the lone David Luis. Let's go. Oh. Totti. It's beautiful. What a finish from the master Totti. Oh my god. Oh, he's given a penalty for nothing, ref. We're doing. Oh my god, I almost got as well. Danny Alves. Wiggling. Oh my, how? Just how has he done that? That's an unreal goal. I don't know what's happening right now. Oh, Fernando Torres, why did he have skills? It doesn't matter, he don't need skills. 
He just banged it in with his left foot. He's only got three star weak foot. Oh my god, he's going to score. Not much power on Perlo's free kicks, but there's a hell of a lot of accuracy and curve. <gasps> You're so almost amazing. I'm going to have to go to extra time. Oh my god, got finished. Oh, oh yes. That could be the winner. Oh, there's Perlo. He's onside. It's 5-3. Game over. There you go, guys. That is the final whistle. We come away a winner. I hope I've shown you, um, well, demonstrated how good some of these players are, how good they could be if they were in the next FIFA or maybe the FIFA after. Let me know who you would most want to play with if they manage to get a legend card after they retire. And uh, let me know if there's any other people that you think would be amazing. That Maybe not on this game, maybe people that you haven't selected for the classic cards. Do you think there's more classic cards coming? I don't even know. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, smash the thumbs up. Go and add me on Snapchat. It's Tom, And I will see you all next time. Peace.